Okay, so as you know, if you watch my blog regularly, I attended the Heritage Classic this past weekend in Winnipeg. And I just got to say, it was a blast. I had so much fun celebrating both the past and the present of our awesome game. Some of the highlights for me were spending lots of quality time with my dad, who I drove out there with, meeting some of the Oilers alumni prior to the start of the game on Sunday, and watching Timu, who I had never had the pleasure of seeing live before, as well as Smitty play one last time in an Oilers uniform. Now everyone and their dog knew that the sun was an issue on Sunday afternoon, but the thing is, it's still Winnipeg. So I made sure that I was prepared, wearing my long underwear, wearing my Marc Messier autographed Oilers fleece, and rocking the beard that I'd been growing for the last few weeks. Man, even with the wind chill, that beard kept me nice and toasty warm. But the problem is, my wife wasn't the biggest fan of it. You gonna have some fun tonight? If you have to ask the question, then you know the answer. She mac teed me. Now, my wife and I didn't conceive a child that night, but back in December of 2012, we did. And just over nine months later, our beautiful daughter was born. And I remember in the days and weeks leading up to the due date, I was distracted and nervous and edgy, especially at work. Sound familiar? Because he's the toughest goaltender by far, and he might be one of the toughest guys in the National League. Look out! As that one gets away from Talbot and goes into the net. Yep. But as soon as she was born, my paternal instinct kicked in. I had more of a sense of pride in my work, knowing that I was providing for my family. I was more focused. Yes, I was exhausted, am exhausted, have been exhausted for a few years now, but I had a renewed sense of purpose. And that's what we're seeing right now with our buddy Cam. His performance has soared since Kelly gave birth to their little twins. Since becoming a dad, Talbot has let in two goals on 101 shots, and he did it against the Blues, Jets, and Capitals, which in my opinion, have been the Oilers' three toughest opponents so far. I know everyone was buzzing about this yesterday, but why do you think the Oilers received the edge in goaltending in this controversial game breakdown by Rob Tichkowski? It's because his numbers are great, and he looks confident and relaxed in the net. Having experienced the wonder of becoming a father myself, I kind of saw this coming. And so just before the season started, I picked up Cam Talbot in four of my five hockey pools. And whew, has it been paying dividends so far. Until next time, let's go Oilers.